Well, the pandemic forced companies and individuals to really look at how they do work. Many companies found themselves asking, do we really need all this office space anymore? Since employees ended up working from home mostly. Claire Kopsky joins us now to talk about what you're calling sort of a hybrid hmm. option, right? Yes. We can anchor from home a yeah. couple of days a week. Exactly. Sounds like yeah. exactly. Let's do it. Well, lots of companies we've been seeing do yeah. this. You hear about the flexibility being given. Yeah. Center 615 is in East Nashville. They're going on 12 years of business and they're a locally owned uh, we work concept that's been going on for nearly 12 years. Some of their tenants have been there the whole time and others found the space as an answer after the height of the pandemic. Less than two miles from downtown Nashville, Center 615 is offering space. There are 92 suites over three buildings. The whole campus is 65,000 square feet. Varying in size, these suites offer businesses a leg up. So many of the stories now pertain to COVID. But even before COVID, conventional commercial leases in an urban district start at three years. And some companies just don't know where they're going to be in three years. The company's mission centers on one word. It's flexibility. We've had so many companies, especially through COVID, shrink. And so the way we uh, structure our lease agreements is as long as you stay within our campus, you can shrink to a tiny suite if your business is struggling and break the lease and move. Nonprofit founder Travis Claybrooks says his organization has greatly benefited from that flexibility. We came here really looking for just a little bit of office space. That's how we started trying to get out of my living room. Creating the separation from home allowed his nonprofit to bloom and not to overspend on space as the organization yeah, ebbed and flowed. If you're starting out and it's only one or two people, you certainly aren't trying to get into a space that could that, that could accommodate 15. You want to save your money and you know try to get somewhere small. But then what does happen when you grow? Do you have to like pack up everything and move to a different to a different space. Um, I'm imagining that probably would have been our story. We would have been trying to relocate, relocate, relocate. Washtopia's CFO says his car wash company wouldn't exist if it weren't for Center 615. I was running an investment fund. Uh, Liz was running a marketing company and we were down the hall from each other and we met through another neighbor in the office space here. And here it is uh, two years after that we started Washtopia and we've been racing down that road ever since. Their company has changed spaces a few times to accommodate for products and equipment, but kept the epicenter the same. The decision makers are all in this one room, and so when new ideas bubble up, they just get implemented in real time. It's a community shared office building that's giving local entrepreneurs a place of their own. I want Nashville to look locally for everything. There's so many talented people in the city like you don't need a national brand, like look to the locals. They're all here. You just got to search. In Nashville, Claire Kopsky, News Channel 5. Center 615 has space for businesses as small as one employee and offers many amenities. To read more about how this office space styled, weathered pre and post COVID, click on this story on newschannel5.com.